Hey guys, this is DB126 here, and welcome back to some more Pokemon White 2. In the last phase, we've left off here in whatever this route is called. I keep on forgetting the names for some reason. You know what? Why don't we check? So it's Route 18. So we left off at Route 18, and today we're going to continue on. Oh, we got a house here. What? Uh, let's see what's inside here. What's this guy? I got a sweet deal for ya. Do you. Uh, you know how Pokemon like to hide behind stones or rocks. Did you find something cool for me? No. How about you? Okay. You have nothing. I think we will have lots of trainers in this route. Yeah, I think we will. So I think, it, pretty sure it will be split into two parts. So we got a black belt here. Shell blade can take care of these fight, these three fighting types that this black belt has. Like the first Pokemon he's gonna send out is gonna be a. A Hariyama. And this thing has a lot of HP despite its appearance. So let's keep on going for Aerial Ace. And it barely lives, but. I will finish it off with any move I have. Ice Beam. What? Really? That's... I thought it was supposed to fail, like... Oh, if you use it one turn. Are you kidding me? Come on, don't do it. There we go. Got a crap load of XP for being a fat thing like that. That's what I like to call it. So next up is a throw. For this thing I'll go into Bolt and then go for Psychic. Does nothing. Or maybe I'll go for Thunder Punch now that it has minus one defense. And it takes it out. And next up is a Hitmon top. Which is gonna go down with a psychic. Oh, come on, really? Oh, I wasn't expecting close combat to take out Bolt. I should have healed up, maybe. Well, I didn't heal up because I thought Psychic was gonna take it out, but. You know, it didn't. I'm just gonna. Go to Dragonfly to finish it off with Earthquake. Oh, heal up Bolt. Since we have three max revives. And there's no trainers there. We have an item right here, which is a Zinc.
I'm gonna go down here. And we... Oh, are you a trainer? Oh! Thought you weren't. And you're just gonna have a uh, hippopotas, or hippopotas as they call it in the anime. And for this thing, I will go into Shell Blade because it's a pure ground type. Oh, I think I should have gone to Overheat. Since it's immune to what it just used there, Double Edge. And we're just gonna go for Surf. And that's gonna take it out. So next up is a crustal, and we are gonna go into Dragonfly. And I am not sure if this crustal has sturdy or not. I'm just not sure about it, if it has sturdy. But we're gonna find out right away. Uh, let's just go for Dragonclaw in case it has sturdy. And we're gonna go for Stone Edge next, because I was just gonna see if... Because I wasn't even sure if it had Sturdy or not. And we're gonna finish it off with Stone Edge. And last up is a Hippowdon. And we're gonna go into Overheat for this thing. go for energy ball what it barely lives and because of the level difference earthquake makes us survive but the sandstorm is gonna finish us off I forgot about that but who cares overheat is like um, is like three levels ahead from it. And we're gonna finish it off with Flash Cannon. So I'm gonna throw Ryu up front. There's nothing there. Oh, I think we know this guy. He's a Sinnoh gym leader. The ring is my rolling sea. The towering waves shaped me. Crash, crash, crash your wake. Crash, crash, crash your wake. Crash your wake. Yeah, I know. You're one of the Sinnoh gym leaders. In the Sinnoh region, in Pastoria City. Yeah, because I played Diamond and Pearl, Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum once. He's also a wrestler. Which is really cool. So next up is a veteran right here. This is going to make the video a lot longer. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's a rotation battle. Why did I forget about that? So I'm gonna... I'm gonna switch to uh, Dragonfly. And go for Stone Edge. Oh! So... So that's good it doesn't go to Crocodile. Mm. 
Let's see what Earthquake's gonna hit. Oh, I forgot. I was gonna go for Earthquake on the Relicanth, but, you know, it, it rotates to a Star Raptor. Maybe I'll rotate right now. Well, I don't have any super effective moves against the Crocodile. So let's just go for Earthquake in case it goes for a switch. Yeah, let's go for Dragon Claw maybe. And I'm gonna heal up. Oh, I didn't know it had Stone Edge. No, please don't rotate to the Star Raptor. Please don't. Oh. Or maybe I'll go for Stone Edge in case it rotates. Oh, I would just went for Stone Edge in case it rotated to the Star Raptor, which it didn't. Yeah, there we go. It doesn't rotate. And an Earthquake's gonna finish off the Relicanth. And maybe I'll switch out for this. Oh, well, I'll heal up Shell Blade first. So now I'm gonna go for Stone Edge and um, hope that he doesn't rotate to the Crocodile. I'm gonna heal up once again. What are you, a choice band or what? Because all I see is just you using close combat and that's it. And I'll just go for Dragon Claw right here. Since it has like minus four defense. And all we have left is just the Crocodile. And I'm just gonna try to use Earthquake right here, hoping that it doesn't have any dragon type moves. Oh, I forgot about Outrage, but it's now locked into Outrage, so I will go into a physical wall, which is Shell Blade. So we're gonna go for Surf. Oh, we survived it. And we're just gonna go for Surf. It's gonna, it's gonna take it out. That sure was a tough battle. Ooh, it's a key item. What is this thing? Magma Stone. Oh, I think I, I know what that does. Um, I think you can catch, like, Heatran with it. Uh, I don't know, but it's something like that. I'm gonna heal up. I'll heal up Dragonfly. Oh, that was a misclick. But before going into the water, we're just going to check if there's any more trainers that we have to do. Let's see, so we haven't gone here. Oh great, we have another veteran. Please don't tell me this is another rotation battle. Okay, good, it isn't. You only have one Pokemon, and that is a Salamence! Good to see some dragon types, and wow, look at that, it's level 70 Salamence, like, wow. Now I'm gonna switch out for this, because it might use like a dragon type attack on me. 
so we're just gonna go to Gatorade, hoping that I could survive one of its attacks, and then we'll go for Outrage. Draco Meteor. Okay then. And we survived that like a boss. But if it uses it again, then it actually won't do that much. Uh, since it also lowers special attack two stages. And because it has minus one attack, Earthquake doesn't do that much. Okay. And we're gonna go for Outrage. And because it has minus two special attack, Draco Meteor doesn't do that much. Now it has minus four special attack. And Stone Edge isn't very effective, so it doesn't do that much. And we're gonna finish it off with Outrage. And we get confused right before we, uh, right after we knock it out. Get loads of XP, EXP for beating that Salamence. And up here you can pick up TM19, which contains Telekinesis. I don't know what that does. I know it's a psychic attack, but I don't know what it does. So now we're gonna surf up here. We're gonna put Ryu up front. And we're back in Route 17. Uh, I think I will go this way. What? What? Where's the sweet Okay then. Ooh, it's Team Plasma. What is this grunt doing here? Oh, it's just you. Neither Getsis nor Colress changed me. So you, I think this guy's a former member of Team Plasma. Let's see what's inside here. Ooh, it's an item which is a dubious disc, and if you don't know what that does, uh, if you have a Porygon 2, uh, you can give it that dubious disc, and if you trade it, it will evolve into Porygon Z. There isn't, there isn't anything to do here rather than just picking up that dubious disc over there. Well, we got a plasma ship. Yeah, where we used to go before. Uh, you can go, you can go back to that maze thing where they have like all those war panels. Then you can battle Colress again, but I won't do that for a while. I'll just take a little break from battling, maybe. And I'll try to decide what I'm gonna do in the next phase. Like if I'm gonna start doing my quest on legendaries, or uh by doing End's Castle, which is one thing I didn't cover yet. I'll try to decide in the next phase. Alright, so next time on Pokemon White 2, um, I'm not sure what we're gonna do. I will decide for the time being. So I, there might not be any uploads tomorrow because, uh, I'll, because I may have still decided, uh, what to do, but who cares? Alright, I'll see you guys then.